What's up guys, hoje eu estou aqui no centro da minha cidade mais uma vez para gravar mais um vídeo mostrando as coisas do Brasil para as pessoas na rua aqui nos Estados Unidos Eu tenho o Sherrod aqui também para me ajudar com o vídeo então hoje nós vamos mostrar alguns vídeos clipes brasileiros para os americanos para ver o que eles acham sobre esses videoclipes então vamos lá uh! I like the choreography, I like the video. I think it's really upbeat. I'm sure in Brazil they go crazy for this just because she seems like she's the pop she's the pop star right now that's out there that she could bring some culture in the American culture with. But I think she can blow up here too. Anita? Yeah. Have you heard of her? I've heard like what I don't even know the name of the song, but I've heard her I've heard her on like features of things. Oh, uh, okay, okay, so cool. Is. Uh as far as like the female population goes, I feel like they'd really attach to this girl. Yeah. I know yeah. who Major Laser is and then I think it's real big that she's on a track with her. Yeah. Him, so I think that'd be real cool. I I think it's cool how you have like like I'm looking at a part right now and there's two girls in pink with a, a mask on and then she's all the way in the front just dancing and then you see all the motorcycles and videos coming around. I think it's real different. I think it's a unique way that they put it in together. I it's, think it's nicely produced, right? Exactly. Yeah, I love yeah. it. I love it. It looks familiar though. The the scene? Yeah, like it, well not really like they in the desert obviously and stuff, but it looks pretty like kind of the same a little bit. Like the, the style of the editing and the yeah. style of it. Yeah. It's pretty dope. The music's obviously different though. Yeah. It sounds good though. You guys like the song? Yeah, it's, it's pretty, pretty good. good. It's a pretty good song. I don't know if I listened to it like that though, but it wasn't bad either. Like you wouldn't have it on your on yeah. your Spotify. Probably not. Probably, probably not. Probably. I just like one time thing, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we had a party or something. Like, hey. No offense, just you know. No, no, no. It's it's pop music, right? Like it's. Right. It's also I it's think it's whatever. like club. You know, yeah, I can exactly. hear that. Yeah, or like it's like, like a club you scene. Get yeah. Down yeah, 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 yeah. You can get down. Yeah. You know, Jimmy. Okay. It's very like Beyonce meets like Lady Gaga, like the yeah. outfits. I like it a lot. It's, cool. it's, it's a little bit different than like what I was expecting. Not, well, it's like it has a Cardi B essence with like a Katy Perry mixed with Lady Gaga. Lots of like pop. Lots of I pop. Like the, I like the pop. Very like a like Western. What, what what were you expecting? Like when I told what I, I was expecting a beach. Like full on beach oh, vibe. Beach. Well like I was not like expecting it to be filmed in a museum and I was like damn. Yeah. <laughs> was, I feel like it was very different, but I yeah. like how they executed it all. Well. Cool. It was really good, yeah. Cool. I think it's really cool. It kinda of reminds me of like maybe some like Britney Spears, like Nicki Minaj kind of stuff. Okay. You know? Some sass. You yeah, know, there's some sass to yeah. it. Like the little thing that comes up. Kind of reminds me of the toxic video. Yeah, I guess when uh, she's like going yeah. through the lasers, we'll, we'll you know? Mm -hmm. Got that kind of vibe to it for sure. Where would you listen to it? Where would I listen to it? Yeah. Or would you listen to it and then where if you would? <laughs> I probably would, maybe like in my car. With the windows down or the windows up? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. Um, probably, I'd, I'd probably do a little bit of both. I'd be like, Sometimes I listen to like a lot of different music and I'm just like, yeah, this is a good song. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna play it, <laughs> you know? So probably with the windows down, I can jam out to it for sure. Cool, cool. <laughs> <laughs> you said you wanted a beach, so. <laughs> <laughs> this is a beach. <laughs> I'm getting lots of like, almost like African dance. I love that because I feel like we don't no, have a lot of that in do, but, um, like so American so music for, videos. Yeah. It's yeah. more just like pop um, dance like, and like it's yeah, definitely like it. more about the music than anything yeah. and her just kind of like feeling the music and like having you enjoy it with her. Like that's why I wasn't talking like this is too good to like interrupt yeah. right now. <laughs> I have to just enjoy it. Yeah, she's powerful. She really yeah. is yeah. very powerful. Okay. And the, the name of the song is actually Jinga, which is like movement related oh, to dance, so that, that makes, makes sense, sense. <laughs> that's yeah. very perceptive. Yeah. <laughs> 
I guess, what do you think about like the dancing in that video? Cause she, she's like really, she's good of a Teach dancer. Teach me how to move like that so I can, you know, move with those hips, you know? <laughs> it looks like it's like, it's like the same as like in the US, but kind of different at the same time. Like their own style of it, I guess you could say. Yeah, so. yeah, for sure. It's pretty dope though. Cool. So could you, so how, could you listen to this on your own? Like, maybe from time to time. I would, like, if I'm like, a longboard race, so like, I would definitely like, longboard race to that. Wow, she's gorgeous. <laughs> right? Dancing around on the beach is, wow, okay. You know, almost like a Rihanna. Yeah. You know, like, Rihanna just has that presence. It doesn't matter what she's singing. She just has a presence to her. And this seems like, you know, it seems like this girl walk into a room and everybody's like, you know, that's that's what's going on. She's going to be here to put on a show. Yeah. Yeah, this is this is definitely like a club song, uh -huh. like a bopping song. They like get in the club and just have some fun with your friends. It's sort of that poppy dancing, but it also has sort of like a tribal vibe to it. Like she's trying to bring in, you know, essences of her own culture into this music while you know keeping the pop image, which is you know something that not everybody can pull off. Some people it seems really forced, uh -huh. but with her it just seems really natural. Yeah, it just exudes that energy and like this just flows. And oh wow, <laughs> yeah, all the candles and stuff. This is awesome. Okay. Oh, this looks nice. Hold up. This is gonna be good. I can tell. <laughs> can I learn the whole choreography? <laughs> this is so cool. This is catchy. I don't even know they're saying, but I'm into it. <laughs> so, if, does she remind you of anybody like American pop stars? Yeah, kind of like Beyonce, kind of like Rihanna. She's got like, you know, those dance moves. Yeah. She's got like the body and the attitude. <laughs> I like it. It's just like a really good like dancing song, you know? So it's like really good high energy. I love the choreography. They obviously have a lot to spend on the outfits and everything, which is cool. <laughs> if, do you have a favorite of those that I showed you? I'd probably say this one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who is it? Isa? Isa. Isa. Yeah. Isa. Yeah, you can say Isa. I guess. This one's so, yeah, this one's really nice. Cool. Like I'm probably gonna go check it out after this. Yeah. Wow. A lot of landscape of Brazil. I feel like you can't really see otherwise. Like free roaming chickens. <laughs> yeah. 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 What do you think of like this, the setting of this one? Because they really I did really, film it. They went into the favelas and filmed. It. I like this a lot better because I feel like I'm getting a more genuine feel of what uh, it feels like to just be in Brazil and live there and kind of. Uh, it's a lifestyle. In yeah, there. be right in the smack middle of the cities. They're all on top of each other, kind of, or buildings. What do you think they're singing about? Or what do you think they the songs about? Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Swimming on a patio <laughs> in a homemade hot tub. All right, I'm curious. We haven't had a girl, any girls react to this song yet. Okay. Okay. Um, <laughs> so keep that in mind as you watch this one. Get lots of butt. <laughs> I have a feeling this song might be about butts because I'm hearing lots of boom booms. <laughs> <laughs> but I like it so far. I'm just upset. I she looks, just, like she just looks so good, and I'm just like, okay, that's great. <laughs> Do you think it's like offensive or is it like? No, oh, I feel no, like it's no, part I of think, the culture. I, yeah, I feel like well, the beauty of bodies is part of the culture over there, yeah. and they're a lot more curvy yeah. over there. Well, in Rio, yeah. everyone is normally in bikinis or like really like short shorts, and everyone just, as you said, loves like the body. Everyone like thinks it's an amazing thing. So I don't, I'm not offended by it by all. Actually, I'm kind of jealous about it. It's yeah. amazing. I'm just like great. Yeah. Thank you. I guess we're going to Rio. Yeah, we're going cool. to Rio. So, um, so out of the three that I showed you, do you guys have a favorite? Well, the first one. The first I one? I love the first one. I like the second one. I don't know, it's like a song I could just vibe out to in the car and just like have it on repeat and just like driving like, yeah. yeah. So I guess like first impressions of just the song, the music first. What do you think? No, I can absolutely bother this. This is something that, you know, I may not know and like understand what he's saying, but I could absolutely like see myself in my car just sort of bopping along to it. Uh, you can really tell that, you know, they listen to, you know, Eminem and listen to rap and they're trying to emulate that and bring it, you know, to their own style too. Yeah. But 
I mean, they're all going. You know, the black and white kind of makes it a minimalist, but like they're on yachts and they're with all these jets and stuff. So it's really cool to have that sort of dichotomy of no color, but still like, look what we're surrounded by and flexing, stuff. Right. And flexing <laughs> and like showing everybody what we're all about. And now I'm at this part with this dude just like eating some dinner and stuff, just kind of <laughs> hanging out. This is, this is awesome. Is it something you would ever listen to or like probably not? Yeah, you know, absolutely. Like... I think that this is something that like, you know, you're at like a summer barbecue or something, and you just put it on a playlist and everybody's like, oh man, what is this? <laughs> and you're like, yeah, this is this is a Brazilian it's rap, you Brazilian know? Brazilian rap, man. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think it's real fast. And re if I understood Portuguese like that, I feel like I'd remember it. Because <laughs> it just seems like it has that vibe and positivity to it. I feel like I'd want to hang out with these people, <laughs> especially because like when the beat when the bass drops and then another guy comes in, that's real cool. Yeah. I like the choreography of it. I like how he's always like he's the first guys all with planes and they all in a BMW and they get out. It's real cool, like, like a, a flashy life. lifestyle. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I love it though. I can't complain.